I wish I wish nobody knew who I was. <laughs> It's not comfortable being me. I don't know. I don't know. I never stepped foot out of the house for a reason. <laughs> it's so easy to look bad in front of people. I don't know. I don't like it. I wish nobody knew me. <laughs> I wish I didn't have a reputation. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the big deal is. I'm just some I'm just some loser making videos about video games. I don't know what the big deal is. <laughs> I don't get it. I think everybody knows who I am, it's ridiculous. <laughs> Nobody cared who I was when I was in high school. I don't want to go back to that. <laughs> See, I'm a loser, see? I suck. <laughs> I'm not good at anything. It's sad. I'm not good at anything. therapist this is my therapy because I used to have a therapist but she doesn't like me <laughs> I don't know she couldn't wait to get rid of me <laughs> I couldn't wait to get rid of her too. I hate therapists. They're not very good at their jobs. <laughs> what do I pay them for? I'm better at this. I should have never paid any of them. I should have just been doing this the whole time. to make me like this. I don't know. Now I feel all down about myself and shit. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever. I wish everybody would get it that I'm just some loser. <laughs> Nothing special about me. Nothing. somewhere bin Laden style and hopefully somebody will find me and kill me <laughs> I don't know 
now. My life's sad. There's nothing going on. I don't know. There's nothing going on. I don't know. I don't fucking know. I want to bash my head open. <laughs> I'm too chicken to do it. I don't know. I wish I was a dumber too. I could never be a samurai. I wouldn't be able to plunge a dagger into my stomach. <laughs> Self-destruction is just not part of my programming. I only destroy others. You have any idea how sad that is? My only talent is fighting. <laughs> That's the only thing I'm good at. That's really sad. Like I was supposed to go swimming today and like, I didn't even want to do that. <laughs> Not exactly proud to show off this wonderful body of mine. <laughs> I don't know, I just don't want to exist. I don't want to exist anymore. doing what I do. I get to be myself and not worry about a thing. <laughs> I don't know, like the internet is the only place where I get to be myself and people will like me for it. I start acting like myself out in public, well, people will think I'm nuts. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe not nuts, but nothing, nothing positive. Nobody would think anything positive of me. <laughs> They'll just think I'm some arrogant prick. And I'm not. I do what I say. <laughs> I am not all talk. I can do what I say. I am the best. <laughs> okay, it's not my fault. It's not my fault that you're not as good as me, okay? <laughs> kind of find that funny. Nobody likes a cocky, arrogant jerk. But on the internet, I don't know, dicks are just funny to watch. <laughs> it's just, it's, I don't know. Jerks are just kind of interesting to watch. You know who's not interesting to watch? 
The fucking Kardashians. <laughs> you guys do know that's a government trap, right? To keep us stupid. <laughs> to have us not... Like, have us care about stupid shit. Not the important stuff. <laughs> You're better off following me. You're better off keeping up with me. like everything I do on these games are just epic as hell like I'm taking out an entire biker gang today by myself <laughs> with nothing but my fists That's epic as hell. I don't know. Real life's not very epic. Unless you're hurting people. <laughs> I don't know. I only feel good when I hurt people. It's fucked up. <laughs> but I've changed my ways. I will never hurt people again. Maybe. <laughs> I go really fucking overboard when I hit, oh uh, no. I beat you till you're almost dead. <laughs> I'll make you think you're about to die. to make sure you never fuck with me again. To make sure everybody gets the message. <laughs> I don't know, I'm real comfortable with violence. Cause I, I grew up being abused. So I'm real comfortable with it. I'm not very scared when people try to hit me. So I'm just so fucking used to it. <laughs> and you know. I let my parents do it. Cause you know. I'm not that terribly par I'm not that terribly proud of my parents. But they're still my parents. So I respect them if they want to hit me or something. I don't know. I won't hit them back. <laughs> but I won't stand for it if anybody else wants to hit me. I won't stand for that. I will fucking kill you. <laughs> I don't kill family. I kill strangers. I don't kill friends. I don't kill allies. I kill strangers. <laughs> People that I don't care about. If I don't care about you, I might kill you at any moment. <laughs> Eyes, throat, balls. You all have a weak point. You're all fucked. <laughs> Do not oppose me. Do not oppose me. I'm an Olympian. <laughs> I was invited to the Olympics, okay? I'm an Olympian. Do not oppose me. <laughs>
I will kill all of you. I'm very mad right now. No, I'm not mad. <laughs> I just, I don't know. I'm just like, I'm just taking a dive off the dark end again. I don't know. Now I'm about to slaughter everybody in Chinatown with a butcher knife. <laughs> I think that's why I play video games all the time. I get to live out my violent fantasies. <laughs> You know what's another violent fantasy of mine? Killing beep. <laughs> I'm not allowed to say it. I would get into serious trouble. I think it's actually against the law to do that. Like, <laughs> I don't think I'm allowed to say it unless I want to go to prison. <laughs> I would never want to go to prison. I wouldn't be able to play any games. <laughs> I am nobody's bitch. I don't need to know you. You all need to know me. I will be the one. <laughs> I love that line. I don't know. I don't know anything. I don't know a damn thing. <laughs> I don't know anything at all. I don't. I'm very uneducated. I'm very stupid. You know, I have a brother and a sister, right? It's almost like I split into two people. Because <laughs> my sister, she has book smarts. Like, I don't know, my brother is not that smart. My sister is smart. <laughs> My brother acts on impulse. Uh, they're completely different people. Like, <laughs> they're complete opposites of each other. Like my brother is very quick to get upset. It's really easy to make him mad. <laughs> I don't know why. He has a pretty girlfriend. <laughs> he has an awesome brother and an awesome sister. I don't know what his problem is. <laughs> I wish I had what he had. I don't know. I don't know why he's upset. I don't. <laughs> Like when he was in high school, nobody talked. He didn't have any friends. Because <laughs> he always had this really scary aura, like I'm gonna kill you look on his face. <laughs> it's like, I, I don't know. I don't know what made him like that. I, I don't know what made him like that. <laughs> But he must have a soft side somewhere.
Yeah. The last person to like... Actually, the very last person to hit me was my brother. <laughs> he punched me in the face. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. <laughs> I didn't do anything before or after that punch. He just gets like that. <laughs> I wanted to beat his ass so bad, like I called my my dad called me. Because my my mom was freaking out. <laughs> and my dad was like What happened? And I kept on shouting, I want to kill him. <laughs> <laughs> you better get here quick, Dad. I want to fucking murder him right now. It's Armageddon every time my family fights each other. It's just Armageddon. <laughs> my whole family. Are, we're very violent people. <laughs> My mom, she lived through the Korean War. So she just always has this survival mode going on. Like, if you even look at her funny, she might fight you. <laughs> My sister is the only sane person. She's our hope. <laughs> she is our hope. She's the only... She's the light. She's the reasonable one. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty reasonable nowadays. I really chilled out once I came... Uh, once I became 30. <laughs> I was just like, why am I so upset all the time? I'm just gonna smoke weed. <laughs> weed chills me out. You know, drugs aren't good for you, but it was, it wasn't all for nothing. It at least chilled me out. <laughs> Drugs aren't good for you. It destroys your brain. You get stupid. Like, I used to be so stupid. <laughs> what are the advantages? What are the advantages of making yourself dumb? I don't know, but I liked doing it a lot. <laughs> I don't know why, like, I don't, I don't know why I like doing it. All it does is make me stupid. <laughs> like, I'm a, I'm good for nothing when I'm high. <laughs> These cops are giving me a hug. I'm not into it. So I'm gonna beat them with a the pipe. <laughs> I don't have... You know, not every cop is terrible. But I used to live at Minneapolis. And God, 70% of them are fucking nuts. Like... Big cities, I'm guessing. The cops will just be really fucking stressed. <laughs> I think that's, you know, I bet a lot of people misbehave and I bet they're just kind of pissed all the time.
You know what's funny? When I used to live at Minneapolis, I heard a gunshot like every month. <laughs> and I would always ask, why did that person get shot? So I don't get shot. Nobody would ever tell me. It's like, I don't know why he got shot. Like, well, God damn it. I want to know so I don't get shot. <laughs> I've actually never played this on this difficulty. I'm playing at the hardest difficulty. I've actually never done that before, and I have to fight three. I have to fight two commissioners. I don't know how that works, but there are two commissioners. <laughs> and a SWAT team member. I guess there's two commissioners in this police department. That's interesting. Must be twins, they look exactly alike. I like that SWAT team girl. She's one of the new characters you can play as. She's actually pretty fun to be. She's like Ronda Rousey with explosives. <laughs> That's the perfect way to describe her. Ronda Rousey is somebody I would never want to fight. See? Ronda Rousey killed me. <laughs> the commissioners I could take out, but not Ronda. That's how it would go, too. Ron that can beat three men. You guys ever seen that? <laughs> she went to Japan and beat three men in a row. No breaks in between. <laughs> and I was like, okay, I guess I'll never get to beat Rhonda. And they were all black belts. And black belts are nothing to fuck with. Do not fuck with black belts, that's not a good idea. <laughs> even if they look like a joke, like even if they're bad black belts, they're still pretty deadly. <laughs> because to be a black belt, you need to at least be able to break Five boards? I'm not, I don't remember. But that's powerful enough to break your fucking bones. <laughs> like three boards are powerful enough. Like if you can break three boards, that's powerful enough to break bones. And black belts can break five. <laughs> So they will definitely break your bones. And x-rays are not cheap. <laughs> One time, uh, a friend of mine broke my arm and I had him pay for the x-ray because it was his fault. <laughs> and he was, he was totally okay with that. He, he felt really bad. You know how he broke my arm? That guy has some fuck. That guy is a black belt too. And like. He has no control over. Like. He has no fucking control, period. He gets so upset. <laughs> it was a friendly sparring session. 
He got mad at me. So he broke my fucking bones. <laughs> he kicked my arm so hard that it broke. Then I looked at our master and said, is this normal? <laughs> I showed him my arm. And I said, uh, I think something's wrong. <laughs> And my master said, Adrian! Yeah, that's right, Adrian. I'm mad. No, I'm not mad at you, but... Yeah, well, I think it's funny, if anything. <laughs> <laughs> There's an example of reputation being ruined. Adrian had to fucking tell everybody on Facebook that he broke my arm. And everybody, you know, people are just so ignorant, you know, like... <laughs> they immediately thought I was a bad martial artist. And it's like... Whatever. <laughs> like for instance, I'm supposed to go bowling today or something like that. And I start sucking at bowling and everybody's gonna think I'm an idiot. <laughs> that guy can't even throw a ball right. What did we ever see in that guy? Wow, Rhonda beat me again. <laughs> I'm gonna keep trying. I'm gonna keep trying though. I wouldn't mind being I wouldn't mind being beaten by women, I don't know. Sounds like a good time. <laughs> Um, it's weird. I like being hit. Like, I'm really close to asking my roommates to hit me. <laughs> but I doubt they would be down with that. They'll probably look at me like I'm nuts. <laughs> Why would you want me to hit you? Because it feels good. <laughs> It feels good. It does. I don't know why. It makes me feel excited. <laughs> and I haven't been, I haven't had any, I don't know. I haven't had any excitement in a long time. kind of appreciative of my neighbors. I think they understand me. <laughs> I'm guessing that's what's going on. Because I never see them. <laughs> like they, they like try their best not to be seen by me. I, I don't know. I don't know what the, uh, I know what, I don't know, I'm guessing they know I'm uncomfortable in the public. <laughs> <laughs> so they do me a favor and pretend that I don't exist, they don't exist. <laughs> I don't know. They send me like weird dog Morse codes. Morse codes. I'm surrounded by dogs. What's the big deal, everyone? I'm just some guy that plays video games all day, every day. <laughs> Nothing special going on here. Nothing special. Just treat me like everybody else. <laughs> if 
you think you learned something from I'm an idiot. If you think you learned something from me, you're an idiot too. <laughs> beat Rhonda today. This is insane. This is three fucking bosses. <laughs> wow. This game's hardest difficulty does not fuck around. I've never had to fight three bosses in any of these games before. <laughs> this is so messed up. Grenades are being thrown around. And I have to fight three fucking awesome fighters. <laughs> Ugh. Rhonda's gonna remain undefeated. Isn't that bit of an overkill, Rhonda? You don't need explosives. <laughs> you're playing as the characters you play as are ex-cops you're beating up a lot of cops <laughs> you sure do, you sure beat up a lot of cops in this game I'm pretty sure you beat up the entire department <laughs> feel better, I don't know. Not really, I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna be limp for the rest of the day, I'm sure. I'm not a warrior right now. <laughs> I'm a whiner today. I'll eventually snap out of this funk. It could be at any moment, in fact. <laughs> I'm very bipolar. At any moment, I could be like... Winter mode activated. <laughs> and that's why I'm so good at comebacks. My winter mode gets activated. to some music.
questing two bosses. Yeah, Rhonda requests backup. And our backup today is two bosses. <laughs> this is fucked up. This is fucked up. How many grenades does she have? She literally has all the grenades in the world. It just never stops coming. I believe Rhonda is dating a fighter. That's a good thing. Because <laughs> if she mixed with a non fighter, then that wouldn't be a good way to pass the torch. <laughs> I wish my. I guess they are. My parents are fighters. <laughs> Finally, I fucking beat Rhonda. Shit. Yeah, my stepdad. He was almost a Green Beret. She just barely didn't make it. <laughs> and even that is a serious honor. The fact that he thought he could be one makes him badass. <laughs> and he is, I've seen him beat people up in five seconds. <laughs> he had every right to believe that he could become one. You won't even know what happened if you fuck with them. It'll be, be, oh, it'll be over before you know it. It'll knock you into tomorrow. And my mom cannot be defeated. <laughs> she she won't allow it. She refuses to lose. I guess she did teach me something. I always thought she never taught me anything. But I guess I learned my winter mode from her. <laughs> my dad taught me how to shoot guns. You cannot beat me when I have a gun. <laughs> it's impossible. Maybe I should become a hitman. <laughs> no. That would be a terrible way to live. I would be so paranoid all the time. Like, I think people are trying to kill me sometimes. I would think that every damn day if I was a hitman. <laughs> sometimes I think people want to kill me. I don't know. I mean, I do know why, but... I don't know. I overthink stuff sometimes. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute, I'm supposed to listen to music. <laughs> 